New tonight, a Round Rock man with terminal cancer gets one of his biggest wishes fulfilled, a new home for his dog before he dies. And it's all thanks to a viral Facebook post. CBS Austin's Adelia Cheetah sat down with him to find out where Diego ended up. Walt Oye. When I was diagnosed, I was given 36 months. Has terminal liver cancer. And last summer, he was told he didn't have long to live. His biggest worry, though, was what would happen to his dogs, Doc and Diego. Doc was easy. He'll go to family. Diego, though. He loves people. He loves to run. And he's a red healer. Diego needed something more. And I thought, well, I can't die and have him in limbo. And with the clock ticking, Oye turned to Facebook. He wrote, it tears my heart out to lose him, but it would bring me great comfort when I die that he is well taken care of. I live in the Austin area. But as of last night, I had 52,000 something shares, uh, over 10,000 messages. Actually, at last check, more than 69,000 people had shared it, even more left comments for Oye. It went viral and now I, I, they crashed my computer and my phone yesterday. <laughs> and among all those clicks and shares and comments, a solution here at the Last Resort Recovery Center outside of Smithville, a rehab center for men recovering from addiction. Oye took Diego there today. No pictures or video, though, because of the privacy concerns of the patient. Diego is going to help the men, but it was an emotional day for Oye. I, I cried down the dirt road. I, it was like cutting a cord, you know, he's like my child. But even though the reason for rehoming Diego is a sad one, the response... I received prayers from countries and people. It's really renewed my faith in mankind, to be honest with you. Has left Oye feeling just a little bit better. In Round Rock, Adelia Uchida, CBS Austin News.